Hello and welcome. Right, Quiet. I'm doing the intro. Hello and welcome to Kansas in the street stock. Um yeah. <laughs> Just doing something stupid for fun. Just something not too serious cuz Things have been too serious lately, so I'm just going to go into this goofy race and have a goofy old time. How about that? Um, obviously, this is going to be super speedway racing here in the street stock on a mile and a half track here at Kansas. Uh, I'm qualifying because I have to. I'm the number one car here in this 2K strike the field. Green, green, green. The moment things start looking scary, I'll probably try to make my way to the back, but... Ah, who even knows? What if uh, it would actually be faster to come at that corner at an angle? I don't know. Just doing the... Super Speedway line, though, for now. This session, whatever. Probably not even doing this right. I mean, I don't know how you could do it wrong necessarily, as long as the foot is to the floor and I'm on the inside of the track. But I don't know. Maybe you want to get a little bit of an angle heading in the corner, or maybe you want to take uh, the first lap as a throwaway. P2. That was a no idea. Something like the angle actually helps out a little bit. Maybe scrub the. Uh, tires a little bit less. I could probably also, you know, turn the force feedback all the way down, but uh, believe it or not, I really don't care that much, and the whole point of this is to not stress out and have a dumb, stupid race with no expectations. So, that's what we're doing. That one was not even faster, so... 7.92 it is. Isn't some so How is someone a tenth faster? What? Are they like running the... <laughs> apron or something? How on earth are you, could you possibly be a tenth faster? No. That didn't work at all. How? No idea how they're going that fast. I like, if I were to do this... I have no idea where they got a tenth from. That certainly didn't work. What could they pos- Do they just have another gear that I don't? I mean, I didn't qualify terribly. A whole tenth, though. How about that? Single matter more than I think. Really? I have no idea where they got that time. That is baffling. There's no fifth gear, right? Okay. <laughs> Just double checking. Not that I would even be on high enough RPMs to shift. That is one of life's greatest mysteries right there, is how they uh, somehow managed to uh, get a tenth. Look, someone went even faster! You what, knight? What is this? <laughs> okay. Well... Maybe we'll see their super secret Mario Kart shortcut in the race. But again, it doesn't really matter where I start. It is a super speedway. So I will just be trying to avoid, uh, Being... Crashed. Probably play it somewhat safe for a while. I actually put my brake bias all the way up so I can stop faster. Let me practice that. Yeah, it looks like I can absolutely step on it and slow down just fine. So, don't have to worry about spinning out or something. Maybe I should have tried that in the corner. But, uh, straight line at least. I can brake. Whole tenth. Session, seventh position. How did you do that? No idea. 
But I'm fully expecting this to be really dumb. I wish that, even though this is obviously a really stupid combo, street stocks here, I wish people would kind of take it a little more seriously. Like, it's kind of the point of iRacing to me is simulating a real race situation, and people never seem to be interested in doing that. I understand it's a dumb combo, but there still can be fun to be had if people aren't doing stupid moves and just wrecking people and being like, oops, I accidentally caused that wreck, but it was awesome, right? You know the types. Oh my gosh, that wreck was awesome. I can't believe it happened after I made it six wide. But, you know, I know what I'm getting into. I'll just laugh as, as I lose another 100 I rating. That's cute. So we'll do uh, all time optimal. See if we can beat some fast laps or something. I wonder if guys were maybe like burning fuel and then going. Maybe the car being lighter helps out. Oh, excuse me, I got like the hiccups or something. But, uh,. Hopefully going to be back into the uploading cycle, I guess you could say, this week. Kind of took a break last week. But hopefully going to get some more racing in this week. I mean, I did do racing last week, it's just I didn't feel very good, and so I wasn't really being too uh, good with commentary and stuff, so I just chose not to upload anything. But feeling a little bit better. And, uh, hopefully gonna have some fun. This is actually, I, I'm talking about this like this is the new week. This is still the race from the previous week. Uh, even though it's Monday. I'm just doing this before the week switches over. For some reason. One of life's greatest mysteries is how they got a tenth on me in qualifying. The other one is why I'm here in the first place. Alright. I know that you usually don't want to shift very much in this car. Seems like, uh... Got plenty of time before we need to shift here in second gear, so it looks like a second gear start. Hopefully we survive long enough to at least uh, just hang out, I guess. We'll turn the people on. I'm gonna regret it. I think I immediately heard a child. <laughs> it sounded like a very high-pitched voice. Luck, luck, luck. About to go green. Stay focused. Good luck. Okay, oh, car is off. Time to do your job. Green, green, flag, green flag. They're off. Car outside. Still there. Go low. We are powering off like a sloth climbing a tree. Like a turtle crossing the road. Still there, hold your line. Clear. All right, not so bad so far. Gonna definitely have to come down to the apron because if I don't, somebody's gonna run into the side of me. I can almost guarantee you, because they're gonna expect me to be down there. Still there. People don't want to lift, even though lifting will help you hold the line better. I can only hope that during this race I will be not followed by someone that's way too over aggressive with bump drafting and things. Not really much I can do about that, but if somebody is uh, going to run in the back of me in the corner and I get wrecked, I mean, there's nothing I can do. It's all luck here. Luck with whoever you're around. Luck uh, with. Guys that are going to wreck in the tri-oval, I guess. That got sketchy. I'll just stay down here, though. That's fine. Oh my gosh. It's okay to lift, guys. 
I promise. I swear guys think that like if they lift they're just gonna go straight to the back but like like the floor entering the corner here he's like drifting up super hard and it's costing him more time not lifting than it would be just to do what I'm doing and just easing off the throttle a tiny bit yeah he's like looking to wreck him like, why would you even bump draft there? I don't know. So the force is probably going to wreck somebody. I was actually in practice with him, and he was polite and nice, but he was bump drafting pretty aggressively. Looks like he plans to do that during the race as well. Really just nowhere to go. I don't even feel like you could get like a huge run and like make your way up late in the race, so maybe I don't want to fall back. Track position might actually end up being important. <sighs> Check it out. We're still not lifting on entry and getting sideways, it looks like. There goes my shot at getting a zero. Yeah, I wasn't getting any room on the inside. Keep low. Yeah, it's kind of hard to pass, I guess. Yeah. Interesting. Still there, hold your line. You're on the bottom, three wide. We're on the bottom, three wide? You what? That's crazy. Can you believe this wild racing we are experiencing at this moment here in Kansas? Still there. Car outside, two wide. Yeah, we gotta line up in the back here, see if we can You're make some time. Still hold. Hold your line. Outside. Guess we're moving Still forward line. a little bit. Keep low. Just gonna hold this bottom line for the rest of forever and I'll probably be fine. Car outside, too wide. Keep low. I don't really want to be on his inside because I feel like he's gonna pinch You're me down here. You're in fifth. Hold your line. Ooh, that got here. You're on the bottom, three wide. Three wide. Still hold. Gad Zooks. Hold your line. That's a one spicy meatball. Do you like my commentating? This is my super speedway commentating. Where you pretend things are exciting, so <laughs> it actually feels that way a little bit. They're running into each other. Holy smokes, he's on the apron. Can you believe that save that lime green number four made? It's kind of like a baby poop. Pea colored. Green. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. Which isn't to say anything bad about that color green. I actually quite like that color green. It's the kind of green that goes really well with like a blue. The next car it's probably my favorite color low. combination. Still hold. Brown, just four wide. Two wide. Just a wee bit of casual Stay four low. wide. The okay, the they're wrecking. I'm going to sit here and get wrecked. Ooh, we made it. Wowie kazowie. That was the whole field. Better save fuel for my pit stop later. Yeehaw! Sorry, Peter, but doors be a little bit there than we do. Nah, you're fine, you're fine. That was a fun reason, I think. Yee-hoo! He got up on that bowl and got bucked right off! That right there was some Talladega racing. So we're in third. Um, about a third of the way through the race. I felt like I held my line just fine. It's are open. I don't know how many got behind me. I barely squeaked through. Got just tipped on the quarter panel. Quarter panel before it all closed up behind me. Not sure why we're brake checking. Everyone 
seems somewhat reasonable. I mean, I, we're four wide, but no one's doing anything too stupid. Take, take damage or just stay out yeah. and pray for the best. Uh, we have tires. Uh, I'm already in the back now. I might as well do what I can. There's a lot of people going in. That's presumably to fix damage. I don't think there's any green white checkers in this series. So that might be worth noting. So we've survived about a third of this race. Got a lot more to go. Hey, can we get a courtesy call and place cars in three? Yeah. Yeah. So I'm gonna. I guess uh, now is the time I can pretend I'm one of the average people in one of these super speedway races. Yeah, I'm having a great time tonight. Got a beer in my right Did hand. Did car ever make it around? Because I got a penalty because he never came up. Uh, something, something out the beer. I was in the um, fifth. I don't know why you were yelling. Dale Earnhardt. Yep. <laughs> I'm blending in well. I'm not insulting anybody, by the way. Like, <laughs> I know that's just part of the sport. Yeah, you were gray on the feed. <laughs> you told me to let you buy, but you One were you gray. You weren't even I tease with you love. Drive, and I had okay, pit, so. Get ready. Race the regime oh, well. at the end of this lap. Now I get a penalty. Harvest goes to the outside. He wants to challenge. They're three wide behind them. They're four wide further back. Everybody four wide led by Kevin Harvick. Four wide and leaning on each other up the back straight away for the final time here in Talladega. Kevin Harvick is there in the lead. Kevin Harvick behind him in second. Kevin Harvick in I guess I'll third. let this play out. Four wide for the rest of the field in three. Here comes Tuck. Okay, I've had enough. <laughs> Just a little bit too... High pitched in my ears. That's uh, it's a lot of fun. Plus, YouTube's got like their content ID thing, like they recognize patterns. It's usually music, but maybe I could get copyright struck if they think I'm uploading NASCAR highlights. So let's not deal with that, I guess. Go green. Is he done? Oh, welcome. The pace car is off. Be ready. Green, 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 green. You're now in third. Getting hit for some reason. Outside. D3. Stay low. Stay low. There is a car well, we overtake P2 because of our big old shove. I've got a Kyle Busch on Stay the outside, low. but I laid off. I literally thought you were going to. I was getting excited. Still there. Clear Thank you for being respectful enough not to do that. Pile bushing, referring to just going full throttle on the outside. Well, it looks. Uh, as the restart's happening and just jumping the start, which is against the sporting code, even though there's no actual black flag in the game. For it. So. That's <laughs> funny, we're behind the guy that we were uh, behind in practice again. Not gonna be bump drafting him. Don't think that's necessary. But I will get very close. Apparently full throttling into the corner has worked very well for him so far. You're not gonna make it time car. So I uh, don't know what I was talking about. He's got it figured.
How would I go about making a move if I needed to? It's much too early. Hey, I'm gonna cut you off and let you go under me. To really be thinking about that all too much, but. I'm not sure if they're gonna be able to. They're really gonna have to put something together on the second lane to get around us, I think. I'm just hoping for another caution to get more stuff fixed. Let's give him the lightest of taps. Being very precise. Trying to give him as much push as I can without actually scooping up the bottom of his. the rear of his car. Because these, uh, these things don't line up too well. Because believe it or not, not meant for super speedway racing. This may come as a surprise. These cars are not necessarily built with Kansas in mind. Usually when you're hitting someone's bumper in this car, it's because you're trying to shove them out of the way, intentionally making them not be in the same lane as you make. So, uh, I'm going to need him not to hit the apron, though. He's just going to drive in the grass, it looks like. Pull those left side tires off. Good idea. Brilliant. Hello. Elementary, my dear Watson. You see, you put the tires in the Hello. grass. The the and the temperatures of the tires You're on the bottom. Three wide. get lower on the left Two side. Wide. This gives more Hello. turn to the car, and therefore less friction. I don't know what I'm saying. Keep low. Sorry, I can't drop uh, because I do damage. Still there, hold your line. Still there. Alright, let's go, Peter, without an E. Without a second E. You're in the middle. Okay, this Hold guy's just line. gonna shove it in there. Oh, there's no line. room. Keep low. Trying to wreck us, I guess. Keep low. I don't know how we didn't end up dying there. He certainly tried Still there. to kill us. Still there. Good consistency. Keep low. You're on the bottom. Three wide. Well, he uh, left Still the bottom wide. open. Still there. Still there. Still I am going to get run over from there. behind by uh, two car if I don't close that off. Hold so your I will be going around. Baby poop green. You're back in second. Clean air. It's getting tons of aero push, so Still glad I'm up there. here. I said jokingly, hey, a bump draft. Wowzers. Sure was crazy. That Still bump there. we got. Hope he knows how to bump draft effectively. Because if he doesn't, I am going to be Still his there. victim. Is this the last uh, race here? Keep low. Got yep. 10 left to go. Okay, you are the leader. God damn it. Thank you. Go low. I agree, you didn't do all. Keeping it on the white line. Go low. No, I'm not I'm more fast than that because I'm losing so many positions. Keep low. Go low. Go low. Everybody bored yet? All right, we're getting bump drafts in the trial now. You heard me saying I was bored, and so now he's going to spice it up with a little bit of risky bump drafting. Not that uh, regular bump drafting isn't risky already. All right, we're not even out of the corner yet. Keep low. 
We are uh, getting hit hard. That really worked out well for both of us. Well, uh, I don't think you were clear. I don't think you had any business putting your nose there. Outside. I see your point. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. Still there. Hold your line. Put my nose where it didn't belong once. I woke up with a kid. <laughs> okay. Outside is clear. The car in front of us is Papa. So we have lost all of our track position. Car outside. Keep low. Low. Somewhere we got a little Hold massive line. run. You're back in pit. You're on the bottom. Three wide. Car outside. Two wide. Still there. Still there. Stay low. I need to calm it down. Close to five. Keep low. <laughs> You're on the bottom. Three wide. Five left to go. Outside. Two wide. You're back in fourth position. Still there. You're on the bottom. Three wide. Hold your line. Car outside. Two wide. Keep low. Still there. You're on the bottom. Three wide. Still hold. hold Ooh, focused. Not talking much. Hold your Baby line. poop's hitting the apron just a little bit, maybe. I don't know. Maybe he's just getting real close. Still hold. Push. We might get third here. P3. That was a thirty-eight point eight. All right. I reckon. The yellow oh. is out. Line up, single file. Close pit road. Is now we find out if there are. Carbide, you had the position when the yellow flag came out. Ah, uh, nope. I guess that sounds like Urza. Are there green white trackers? No, that'll be it. You want to be definite? Line up, single file behind car number eleven. That'll be it. Under caution, pits are closed. Oh, okay, then. I'll take, I'll take it. it. Good race, good win. Sorry for being snarky, number two. I know that's just how this racing works. No, man, that's no worries. I, I think we both could have uh, done different there, and I think we both would have liked to have done different there. Yeah, I was being stubborn. Probably not the best idea. I was going to end up having us wrecked, so... Yeah, no hard feelings either way. Pete Road is now open. No, man, no, it's all right. It's all right. Glad we were both able to get it straightened up. Half back, 11. The way to go, one car for spinning through the grass. That's third. I don't know how I ended up back up here, but uh, yeah, I'll take it. Yeah, good racing, guys. I appreciate you pushing me there. One, I know it was getting pretty tight. Yeah, it was just like practice earlier. That was fun. Good win. Yeah, appreciate it. Yeah, that, uh, that practice paid off. Yeah, like I said, I was in a was in practice with him. Two more, let's go. Uh, before this session, so that's kind of funny. So uh, P3, somehow I don't lose I rating in this. Get 11, it looks like, approximately. Yeah, 
17. Got the lucky dog. And uh, just a 1x from ending up in the grist. Yeah, well, lucky dog gone high anyway. <laughs> Alright, at least you finish all the lead, right? right? So that didn't go so bad, honestly. Um, obviously, everyone's aggressive and stuff, but I didn't see anything too dumb. I felt like the two was a little aggressive on it, but that's kind of just what you have to do. So it's understandable. I mean, I'm also protecting the bottom line pretty hard, but I mean, that's just the line. There is no racing line, quote unquote. You kind of just run at the bottom, or uh, if you so choose, run the second lane in the draft. <laughs> so I uh, was. Doing my best not to leave an opening down there. Um, what flag to kind of tried to pry the door open. And uh, I was stubborn and didn't want to let it go. And uh, two stubborn race cars meeting each other can often lead to danger. <laughs> so I'm glad it didn't turn out poorly. Like I said to him, I know that's just how this racing works. So, uh, I hope, uh, a 15. How's your car driving? Hopefully it doesn't, uh, resent me for being a jerk like I always am. Always a grump. I have no idea. I'm just watching you drag the, uh, the right front doing the, the, the Lightning McQueen at me. It's hilarious. <laughs> the 4 has become the pace car. He was assimilating with it a moment ago. I wonder what happened that uh, final wreck. I didn't. I wasn't really looking in my mirror, so I don't uh, know what happened. But we'll see what the wrecks looked like. Maybe even see uh, myself end up in the grass for a little bit. But I will be, I guess, the Cal Naughton Jr. to uh, <laughs> Peter with one E's. Ricky Bobby, push him to the victory. <laughs> Though he kind of did it all on his own at the end there. But that'll do it. Look at this thrilling photo finish. Whoa. We did it. Great drive. That's a ticket flag. Let the five. I'm pulling it on. Good way and good way, everybody. Solid work. Beep boop beep boop beep boop. Pass the ten. And park. Pass the thirteen. Car. Tires 95, 92. Keeping it on the right rear. <laughs> Let's take a look at the Rex. Waste no time. Oops. Just hit print screen by accident. That will not be the thumbnail. Two fails to hold his line, although I think he might have gotten the call that the nine was below him. So he might have thought he had to leave room, but the six doesn't know that. So that's why that's pretty tough. Two has to go up like he's leaving room for three wide, six wasn't ready for it. Very luckily, nobody gets sideways from that. So everything's all good. There I am at the bottom of this. Oh. Nine maybe has to leave a little bit extra room there if they're three wide, and then they kind of get hooked together. The one's losing control and then drifts up because of the contact, and I thankfully. Ooh, he almost turned down into me. Thankfully, he turns it away and then unfortunately loses it. <laughs> and then here it comes the big one. Here comes the boom. That's pretty much everybody. Whoa, that guy snuck through. We're going to look at our US Bank safe move of the race. Safe banking move of the race. I don't know. <laughs> he gets tapped, but he makes it through. Dave. So uh, they wreck or whatever. The 21 ripping the t the top into the wall. 
pretty wide. 17 giving minimal room. Looks like they luck out. No one ends up crashing. 20 drives it into the wall. Is this where the two come, goes on my inside or no? No, not yet. Somehow doesn't have grip. Okay, this is... Yeah, you gotta let me in, man. <laughs> uh, so what happens? Did I leave more room than I thought? Uh... I don't know. Is he alongside me? That's about as tough of a call as you can get. You know? I guess he's on my inside. I swear the spotter didn't say anything, though. And it's not like I can... Well, I guess I could have moved up. I don't know. Maybe that's on me. <laughs> I wasn't about to fall all the way back. I kept my foot in it. And after I considered the two to be the cause of that, I, uh, was not going to ask very politely to be given room. I held my line. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Maybe I'm as bad as anybody else. I'm glad the two and the eight save it. We... <laughs> All gets figured out! Oh no! So this was the, the wreck that ended it. What have we? Oh, the 20 like overdrives it or something. That's weird. He like turns in late. And then the 15 kind of tries to go to his inside but doesn't really get there and then... Uh... Boom, 2.0. That will end it. Not quite as big as the last one, but still not very fun to be a part of, I imagine. So uh, what I'm actually going to do here is... Going to go back just a little bit. Where am I? Okay. How did I even get back up there? Because we have that moment and I lose all my track position. <laughs> I kind of forced my way back on, but I didn't really have much of a choice. So we're back in seventh. And then we just get a massive run. I guess because we had some space and I didn't have to check up. Also, it helps that the 20s taking the apron on entry for some reason? That's a weird one. Though that doesn't actually even help me. I remember at one point I'm too aggressive because I was driving a little bit agitated. So I'm probably going to be mad at myself here in a moment. I don't know why 20 thinks the outside's going to work there, but he gets, uh, leaves the bottom open. Yeah, this is where I'm a little aggressive. You either die a hero or live long enough to see yourself become the number two. I basically almost did what he did. Where I'm like, oh, I'm gonna stick the nose there. I'm there. Hee hee ha ha. But then I'm like, nope. This is what where, uh, where he and I differed. I let off and was like, no, that's not gonna work. So I let off. Because the five wasn't gonna give me the room. So thankfully that worked out. But I didn't need to stick my nose there in the first place. That was dangerous. Uh, 
I just remember guys kept leaving the bottom open, and that's just where you wanted to be. Like the five here? He uh, goes for the middle, and I'm just, I'm not so sure about that buckaroo. Because I get to go down here. That's right, I did give the four a little bit of a, a shove again. Come on down here, and then uh, we're on the bottom where you need to be. Shortest way around in this Flintstone foot-powered car. And uh, look, who's now passing the five because he gave up the bottom. And then I saw the two here and I'm like, I hope he's not like secretly angry at me, even though he sounds polite over the uh, radio. That could have ended up with him getting into the back of me, but then they wreck. So uh, it doesn't happen. How close were we to second place? I am curious. I'm going to keep an eye out for the caution. Caution's not out yet. hope this is interesting. I'm ahead of him. What? Caution's not even out yet. Scoring loops, though. So I was technically ahead of him when the caution came out, but the scoring loop takes you back a little bit. So... It's too bad. Who cares, though? One spot. Um, but scoring loops, in case you're unfamiliar with it, um, when a caution comes out, it doesn't matter necessarily where you are on track. There are different sectors divided up through the track, and so they'll reset to what the previous timing zone, which might have been, for example, I don't know, I'll just say right here or something. Wherever the scoring zone was, he must have been ahead of me. I was ahead of, ahead of him for a good while, though, so I'm guessing it must have been, like, right here or something. Really close. I had to have been super close to being P2. But uh, scoring must have been, like, halfway between 1 and 2 or something. And that uh, caution comes out. And uh, it scored us. P3, which I'll take. That is A-OK. -okay. Probably would have been wrecked had this gone to the final lap, so uh, that'll work. So that was Street Stocks at Kansas. Went much better than I expected, even though I took a trip through the grass. Um, Kind of fun for what it is. Uh, I think I achieved the goal of just having a low-stress, no-expectations race, and uh, not so bad. So... Um, apologies again to the two for being snarky. <laughs> Congrats to the four. The guy I practiced with for getting the win. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you next time.